Rika rero twongere tugaruke ku mubano w'igihugu cy'u Rwanda ndetse n'igihugu cy'abaturanyi cy'a Republika iharanira demokarasi ya Kongo aho rero ibihugu bitandukanye birimo leta zunzu ubumwe za Amerika ndetse n'ubwongereza byatanze impuruza ko ibihugu bishora kwisanga mu ntambara nta gikozwe ndetse byo binagaragaza igikwiye mu rwego rwo gukemura ibibazo ahanini kuri ubu ni guterwa n'intambara M23 ikomeje guhangana mo n'abasirikare ba FARDC bafatanyije na FDR no muryango wabibumbye wemeje ko intumwa z'u Rwanda n'iza Republika iharanira demokarasi ya Kongo zigiye guhurira i Rwanda murangura ni mu biganiro bigamije guhosha umuka mubi uvugo hagati y'ibihugu byombi mu mwuka ushingiye ku birego Republika iharanira demokarasi ya Kongo ishinja u Rwanda ko urufasha umutwe wa M23 ni mu gihe rushinja icyo gihugu gukorana n'umutwe wa FDRR ndetse ingabo zacyo zikaba ziheruka kurasa mu Rwanda ibisasu bitandukanye byanasenye inzu bigakomeretsa abantu Umuyobozi w'ubutumwa bwo mu ryango wabibumbye bwo kugarura amahoro muri Republika iharanira demokarasi ya Kongo buzwe nka Monisco Bintu Keita kuri uyu wa gatatu yari imbere ya kanama ku muryango wabibumbye gashinzwe umutekano haganirwa rero ku kibazo cy'umutekano muke mu burasirazo bwa Republika iharanira demokarasi ya Kongo yavuze ko ibyo bibazo by'umwe hariko ibijyanye no kubura ako imirwano kwa M23 ngo bishobora gusubiza inyuma intambwe zari zimaze kugerwaho uh, hisunzwe hi ibyaganiweho hagati y'igihugu cy'u Rwanda ndetse n'igihugu cy'a Republika iharanira demokarasi ya Kongo byumwari ko rero ngo bikaba byanasenya umubano uri hagati y'ibihugu bya karere kose muri rusange yakomeje ati bityo rero ndasaba Republika iharanira demokarasi ya Kongo n'u Rwanda kwifashisha inama inama igiye guhuzwa na president Joao Lourenço i Rwanda mu mwanya wo gukemura ibyo batumvikana ho binyuze mu biganiro Agataho rero ni ngombwa ko ibihugu byombi bikomeza gukoresha inzira zashyizweho mu karere mu buryo bwo kugenzura ibibera ku mipaka IGVM mu gukemura ibyo batumvikanaho kandi uh, bashingiye ku imenyetso bifatika ntabwo umunsi nyirizina ibiganiro bizaberaho uratangazwa mu kanama gashinzwe umutekano ibihugu byinshi byagaragaje ko bishyigikiye uburyo bw'ibiganiro aho kuba ubwa gisirikare urugero ambasaderi wo bufaransa mu muryango wabibumbye Nicolas yashyigikiye ko ikibazo cy'umutekano mu kimwe muri Republika iharanira demokarasi ya Kongo gikomeza gukurikiranwa mu buryo bwa karere binyuze mu biganiro bya Nairobi yamaganye ibitero bishya bya M23 ku ngabo za leta ndetse na Monisco kimwe n'iyindi mitwe irimo Codeco ADF ndetse na FDRR we yakomeje ati ubu Faransa buzakomeza gushyigikira ko habaho ibiganiro hagati ya Republika iharanira demokarasi ya Kongo n'u Rwanda binyuze mu buryo bwashyizweho ndetse n'inzira za diplomasi ndanagaruka ku buhuza bwatangijwe na prezida wa Republika ya Angola ku bufatanye n'ubumwe bwa Afrika ambasaderi wungirije wa leta zunzu ubumwe za Amerika Richard M Myers we yasabye imitwe yitwaje intwaro ikorera muri Republika iharanira demokarasi ya Kongo guhagarika ibikorwa byayo igashyira intwaro hasi iyo mu gihugu igafashwa gusubizwa mu buzima busanzwe naho ikomoka mu mahanga yo igasubira iwabo yakomeje ati turasaba Republika iharanira demokarasi ya Kongo n'u Rwanda gukomeza intambwe nziza zigamije guhosha umwuka mubi dushyigikiye ibiganiro bya Nairobi n'u Ruhare rwo ku rwego rwo hejuru rwa president uh, wa Kenya ndetse na president wa, wa Angola kuri iki kibazo turifuza gukoresha uyu mwanya mu gushimangira ko buri gihugu kigomba kubaha teritwari y'ikindi cy'abaturanyi we rero yanagarutse ku magambo y'u Rwanda yuko muri ibi bibazo monisco irimo uh, irimo gukorana ningabo za FDRR hamwe na FRDC ngo ko bishobora gutuma izi ngabo 
zibasirwa maze nawe agira icyo bitangaza ko yagize ati RDC ifite inshingano zibanze zo kurinda abaturage bayo kandi US cyangwa se leta zunze ubumwe za Amerika yiteguye gutanga umusanzu wayo mu bufatanye na Republika Iharanira Demokarasi ya Kongo byumwe hari ko muri ibi bihe bikomeye ndasaba abayobozi ba Afrika y'uburasirazuba gukoresha uburyo bushingiye ku biganiro Leta zunze ubumwe za Amerika zirashimangira ko kohereza izindi ngabo mu burasirazuba bwa LDC bigomba gukorwa mu buryo buhuriweho na Monisco kandi bigakorwa hakurikijwe ime uh, ibimenyetso ndetse nibyemeranyijwe ho n'impande zombi na mategeko muza mahanga harimo ni itegeko mpuza mahanga ry'uburenganzira bwa muntu bigomba kandi kujyana n'imyanzuro ya kanama ku muryango wabibumbye gashinzwe umutekano mu bijyanye n'ibihano byashyiriweho Republika Iharanira Demokarasi ya Kongo kuko hereza izo ngabo bikamenyeshwa kandi aka kanama mbere yuko zoherezwa yakomeje ati ndasaba Republika Iharanira Demokarasi ya Kongo Rwanda n'ibindi bihugu bigize umuryango wa Afrika y'Uburasirazuba guhosha umwuka mubi maze bigafatanya gushaka igisubizo kirambye ku bugizi bwa nabi n'umutekano muke mu Burasirazuba bwa Kongo intumwa yungirije y'ubwongereza mu muryango wabibumbye James Kaliyuki we yavuze ko ibyago byuko hashobora kubaho intambara noneho yo ku rwego rwo hejuru kurubu ngubu ngo biri hejuru kuruta ikindi gihe yakomeje ati hakenewe guhosha umwuka mubi ku mpande zombi kandi hakubaho aho busugire bwa buri gihugu guhosha umwuka mubi kandi bigomba kugendana no kurwanya imvugo z'urwango cyangwa se gushaka gushora abantu muri ibyo bikorwa yashimiye ibiganiro birimo gukorwa ndetse bikagirwamo uruhare na president Kenyatta ndetse na Joao Lorenzo avuga ko ubwongereza bubishyigikiye yashimangiye ko mu gukemura ibibazo bi hagati y'urwanda na Republika iharanira demokarasi ya Kongo abo ni gisubizo kiri mu biganiro n'inzira za za diplomasi kurusha imbaraga za gisirikare yanasabye kandi leta ya Kongo ko muri ibi bihe ikwiye uh, gukuramo ibihe bidasanzwe yashyizeho mu ntara za Ituri na Kivu ya Majyaruguru maze hagasubizwaho ubuyobozi bwa gisivile bwasimbuwe bwasimbujwe ubwa gisirikare ngayo nguko rero ngibyo ibishobora kuba mu gihe cyavuba nuko urwanda rushobora gusubira mu biganiro na Republika iharanira demokarasi ya Kongo na cyane ko abayobozi batandukanye hirya no hino kwisi bose bakomeje kuguhuriza kukugana inzira y'ibiganiro aho kwifashisha inzira za gisirikare a core mandate uh, it is also impacted by the fact that uh, in order to prevent uh, goma to be taken by m23 which was the situation back in 2012 we have brought a number of our forces in petit nord and frdc has also done the same uh, so which means that uh, in grand nord in uh, put in uh, in uh, ituri and uh, other places uh, in the country uh, forces have been depleted in order to uh, fight uh, m23 and that uh, is uh, really something which is uh, concerning because it means that uh, in that time adf and codeco and zaire and other my my groups uh, are taking advantage of the vacuum that has been created by uh, this uh, situation and this uh, uh, which is uh, uh, worrisome because uh, we were having joint operations with FRDC as a MONUSCO force uh, and uh, going even into unilateral uh, type of uh, operation, particularly in Ituri with CODECO. And this is how in, on 5th of April, we lost one of our Nepalese uh, uh, peacekeeper. And uh, so looking at all of this, the question becomes, okay, what is the end game? Uh, and uh, when we are looking at the end game, it's uh, really uh, for M23 trying to, uh, to get to the negotiation table when uh, clearly the uh, year 22 where we are finding ourselves is no longer the situation of 2012 or 2013. Um, this, the country has evolved. My predecessor, Leila Zerugi, has worked very hard with the team, the entire team of MONUSCO, 
uh, to come with the international community, the partners, the bilaterals, the multilaterals, to a place where lessons have been learned about how to go about uh, disarmament, demobilization, and reintegration of armed groups. The President of the Republic last year has signed an ordinance which clearly stipulating that nowadays handling armed groups, they should not come with uh, what we call the cahier des charges, they have to come ready to integrate uh, what is called the PDDRCS, and uh, this is with uh, two principles that are extremely key, which is one, there is no amnesty, and second, there is no automatic reintegration integration into the security forces. So that is something where people are talking about the Nairobi process as a negotiation. I want to make sure that we understand it's not about negotiation, it's about consultations, in order to get into the PDD-RCS, not uh, reopening uh, uh, like uh, getting into a table for negotiations. Um, and uh, finally, uh, I think it's also important to remember that North Kivu uh, and uh, Ituri are on the state of siege, so we were all advocating, including Congolese themselves in various levels, civil society, parliament, National Commission of Defense uh, of the Parliament, Defense and Security, in order to recalibrate or to lift the state of siege in preparation of the elections for December 2023. Uh, so now with the situation in Petit Nord, it becomes even difficult to do that uh, immediately. And the other piece uh, attached to it is that while we had just had the electoral law reform uh, setting the siege for uh, the uh, elections, uh, the preparation of the elections, the voter registration may be impacted by the fact that we have these uh, fights that are continuing in uh, so many places. Uh, thank you very much, Madam Kaita. Um, the, you, you were just mentioning the Nairobi uh, meeting. Um, can you tell us um, anything further about the deployment of a regional force and how it might um, interact or possibly clash with MANUSCO? So I would like to see the regional force, the decision of the head of state to deploy this regional force um, as something, an, a special effort, an extraordinary, uh, extraordinary effort in order to cater for the situation, the deteriorating situation that they see in the eastern part of the DRC. And I would like to see it as a complementary effort to MONUSCO, because MONUSCO also has a mandate to deal with the armed groups and to protect civilians. Uh, in that in that context, the most important element and feature for us is the coordination. Uh, coordination, coordination, coordination. And fortunately, what we understand is that the coordination, the force headquarters for the regional force is going to be based in Goma, where we have now a coordination center with FRDC, which is going normally to facilitate the coordination, the sharing of intelligence, and also the planning of the operations uh, in, uh, uh, between the different uh, contingents that are going to be part of the regional force. Now, um, when we look at complementarity, we also need to, because we don't have yet the CONOPS, uh, the concept of operation for the uh, regional uh, uh, force. So it's very important that we have the clarification in terms of clarification of roles and responsibilities and the delineation of how 